Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to the episode of Spitting Venom, aka the Venom Vlog. And there is some movie news that kind of came out today, very brief things though. I don't have anything major and I'm going to, you know, do a little bit of digging, um, you know, later on in my lunch break when I get to work. So I'm recording this really quickly, but it might not go up till later tonight, uh, which is Monday. And uh, yeah, I just got finished posting some videos and I got to start getting ready for work. It's like, and I have the Ubisoft thing going on right now from E3. So I'm just um, t too much multitasking, I think, going on. Uh, so anyway, what we found out is First, we saw this image. This got released of Tom Hardy on the motorcycle, which we kind of saw in the trailer. So not really a big deal, and honestly, not very exciting to me. Um, it's like, all right, fine, we got another shot of him, great. Uh, but at this point, now that we've seen a peek at Venom, we need more stuff like that or more intense things. Uh, just him, you know, in this cool pose on a motorcycle isn't going to be enough to keep people excited. Because the thing is, and the thing Sony has to remember is, just because that trailer did really well. There's a lot of people out there that still, you know, are going to lose touch with this movie, they'll lose interest in this movie, they're still going to complain that Spider-Man's not in this movie, and how can they do this movie without Spider-Man, and Sony really needs to step it up as far as, like, keeping people interested, and I know they can't show a ton and get a ton, you know, out there and, and spoil the movie, I know they can't do that, but they got they got to do a little bit better than just an image of Tom Hardy on a motorcycle. Uh, but I'll have the image there. Check it out. It's online now. Uh, but then also this came across my attention, and I think Venom Gaming sent me this. So Venom Gaming, thank you. Uh, there's a link to Hollywood Reporter in the description box below. And what it says is uh, there is a Cine Cinema Europe, or Cinema Europe, uh, is this presentation that's going on right now. And uh, Sony showed up, and they're showing off a bunch of their movies, like Goosebumps, uh, the Goosebumps sequel, and The Crown, The Girl with the Spider's Web. Uh, they're showing off a lot of their movies that are coming out, uh, Hotel Transylvania, that kind of stuff. And then they actually showed off some uh, extensive footage from the Venom movie. So I'm sure at some point we might hear about that, uh, what they showed. We might hear about what the details are online. If any of you know, we can talk about it down in the comments and maybe I'll do a follow-up video after we find out. Um, but apparently they did show that and uh, Stephen Adele from Sony actually had this to say. He said the most chaotic and unpredictable Marvel character finally got his own film. Um, so that's I guess uh, he said it's one of their most exciting projects in years is how he describes Venom. Uh, so you can tell from the words he's saying that he's trying to get people excited. They're showing off footage which is great um, and they're doing it at these exclusive events which is fine by me. You know, I, you know we don't need to see every little thing that comes out of this movie. At least I I don't feel like we do but if they're getting these cool things and they're seeing actual shots of venom or like or battle scenes or something very exciting then sony at the same time shouldn't also just release an image of tom hardy on a motorcycle <laughs> so that's why i wanted to talk about both these in one video because they're tied together sony's like we got to give people out there something because we're going to show people here something and it's like great but you showed the people there something very very exciting and you gave us just kind of this mediocre image and so it's like it, it, it needs to be a little bit better than that like i'm not against us getting anything it's great for me for content i can talk about it uh, and you guys may really like the shot of him on the motorcycle i think it's fine it's what you know we saw this kind of in the trailer so it's nothing new and it doesn't really bring excitement to me and I think that is the case for a lot of people out there they're just like oh another Eddie Brock image and that's kind of the narrative that's going to keep forming um, and again I don't want them to show everything Venom related but they should show more maybe if they're going to do Eddie Brock have them looking at his hand with the symbiote you know forming around or something like give us something like that that's new and different uh, that we might you know like or show us like a foot of you know or, or a hand of another symbiote with Eddie Brock in the background and he's like looking up at it and you see something walking Walking towards them or you know, something like that. I mean, maybe that gives too much away, but I think a lot of us are already speculating and already know from the trailer, the second trailer specifically, that there are other symbiotes that are going to be in this movie. So maybe it's time we see, you know, a glimpse of one of their hosts as well. Uh, and I feel like that won't be giving too much away. And it also just make an, an image of Eddie Brock look more exciting. Uh, but you guys let me know what you think of all this down below. Check out the Hollywood Reporter article. It's just not much, just a little blurb in there about Venom. Uh, but let me know. And if you heard any other information about what kind of footage was shown, let me know in the comments down below and we'll talk about it. And if it's interesting enough, I'll make a follow-up video. Thanks for watching my show. As always, like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and I'll see you in the future. Peace.